The News for Jack's I team is continuing to investigate what happened leading up to the fatal dog attack of a mail carrier, Pamela Rock, in Putnam County. Rock was killed in August of last year, and her family says they are still in disbelief. The attack wasn't the first time the dogs were involved. The dogs involved were brought to the attention of authorities. Now, I team investigator Ann Maxwell has new details about the contentious history of Putnam County animal control. The News for Jack's I team has explained how the owner of the dogs involved in the attack wasn't charged, in part because he had tried unsuccessfully to surrender them to animal control twice, including just 10 days before that deadly attack. Tonight, we're hearing an animal control officer's explanation about why the dogs weren't accepted. 10 days before these dogs mauled Pamela Rock, Putnam County Animal Control received a report about the dogs attacking a car. An officer left a note on the owner's fence. When he called them back, he asked for a second time that year about surrendering his five dogs. He spoke to the I team with his identity concealed. I couldn't afford them all. You know, I couldn't afford to feed them all. And I was trying to get help. I wanted them to get good homes you know, somebody that would care for him. He said the dogs were strays that he had started feeding, and then one had puppies. After Rock's death, Animal Control Officer Donald Ferguson explained to an investigator with the state attorney's office why they didn't accept the dogs. Due to our policy, we don't take owner surrenders unless of dire needs. Um, and this is not a dire need situation because he just couldn't afford them or whatever the case may be. Uh, we're not gonna take custody of somebody's dogs just because. Putnam County Animal Control is housed in a cramped facility at the local landfill. The 2021 county budget shows $750,000 were allocated to build a new animal control facility by the sheriff's office, although construction has not yet begun. Local animal activist Mike Merrill says the shelter in Putnam County is overcrowded, like others in the area. It's not a Putnam problem. This is everywhere and it's the community. The 2021 county budget also shows animal control had issued zero citations since moving out from the umbrella of the sheriff's office in 2014, even though they had the authority under the law to issue them. To Pamela Rock's brother Tom, that's unacceptable. Out of sight, out of mind, total neglect. I thought they worked for the sheriff. It would make sense and that would solidify the connectivity and meetings and all that stuff. In fact, missed communication between the two agencies resulted in animal control reporting they had never heard about the dogs attacking a neighbor, Howard Clough, who was hospitalized six months before the attack on Rock. The sheriff's office had responded to that incident. Now we have people hurt and there's no accountability. Merrill says the sheriff's office and animal control still follow up on animal cases in the county, and he doesn't think animal control is at fault in the attack on Rock. They can't be everywhere. They can't be responsible for everybody's individual dogs. He suggests mandatory spay and neuter laws would help. I think it's a very tragic situation, but I think it's a big mistake to try to blame the county. It's a mistake to blame animal control and the sheriff. The dog's owner says he thinks animal control should be more proactive. I think they need to try to do better than they've been doing. But, you know, they can't be everywhere all the time. But, you know, when somebody complains about dogs, they need to step up a little bit, I think. Clough is also unhappy with how the situation with the dogs was handled. Would you like to see something done? Yeah, I'd like to see um, they all go to jail. Who? Putnam County. The Rock family is proposing an investigation to determine who or what agencies should be held accountable and what changes should be made to make sure something like this never happens again. Pamela Rock's brother Richard says the people of Putnam County deserve more. Currently, we have a huge gap in the direction of citizens because of bureaucratic delays or inaction. We have reached out to the county and county commissioners on whether what happened will be investigated. We have not yet heard back, although one of Rock's brothers says they have set up a meeting with county officials. From the studio, Ann Maxwell, Channel 4, The Local Station.